Hello children, today I'm going to tell you a new story. In case you haven't realized yet, this story is about Christmas. Oh Christmas, what a wonderful holiday, filled with colors and lights and joy. I think everyone loves Christmas. Well, maybe not everyone, but the story I'm going to tell you now is about a very old man named Boozoo. He was selfish, greedy, rude, filled with anger, and most importantly, he hated Christmas. But on this story, Uzu will get to see the true meaning of this wonderful holiday. Uzu in a toy shop. It was a very nice and pretty toy shop. Everyone loved to go there. All the kids loved his toys. There were all kinds of toys in there. Big and small, cheap and expensive. Uzu would make a lot of money off his toys, especially during Christmas. And this is where our story begins. Our story begins at Boozu's toy store during Christmas Eve. Fanny was cleaning the store as usual, until all of a sudden... Oh no! Fanny said as she could hear her boss, Mr. Boozoo, walking towards her. Fanny! You incompetent bunny! Did you break that mug? Yes sir, but, uh, but, but I didn't mean to! Uh, I can fix it! No, no. I'm gonna have to take this out of your payment. But, but, sir, it's Christmas Eve! How am I supposed to feed my family now? Not my problem. Besides, I don't believe in all that Christmas garbage. Now get back to work. I don't pay you for nothing. You're not gonna pay me, sir. Get back to work! Could it be at these hours? Why, you, hello there, good sir. Pleasure to meet you. I was wondering if you were willing to help us raise money for the poor people on Christmas. Hmm. Well, but you're not supposed to do that. This is my store. I can do anything I want. Besides, I'm not going to give a single cent for this stinking holiday. You are a greedy and selfish old man. I hope you know yeah, that. Yeah, get lost, kiddo. Well, Merry Christmas to you too, Jock. Well, today was exhausting. I don't really expect tomorrow to be any better, though. God, I hate Christmas. Hmm. I... Yeah, I should get some sleep.
Hello? Anyone? I don't even celebrate. Wait a second. Gifts? For who? Oh well, a present is a present. Let's see what we've got here. Clown toy. What the? Open the door. Is this some sort of prank? Because it's not funny! What? What's going on in there? Hello? Come closer. Come closer. Who are we? What are you? Why, I am the sad ghost of past experiences. I am here to show you the past. The past? Indeed, my friend. Why would you want to show me the past? Because you've been a bad person. What? You have stolen. You have lied. And you've been greedy and selfish, haven't you? I, I, I have not. Lord, do not lie to me. I'm not lying to you. I don't want to hear you laugh. You don't want to hear me cry. So let's do each other a favor and a few regrets. Let's do each other a favor and a few mistakes.
Oh, you shall stop in and you shall buy. You can lose and yet you deny. To have been so greedy and selfish your entire life. You need to accept that you've done bad stuff, old man. I don't need to accept Maybe any because of your past. You had a pretty mediocre child, didn't you? As a kid, nobody will give you presents. And you haven't celebrated Christmas ever since. How do you know that? Sometimes. Our past can lead up to our future actions. You've done bad stuff. But there's still some time to fix your mistakes. Wilson. I don't have to fix anything. <laughs> Stop lying. I'm not lying. Don't lie to me. I'm telling the truth. <laughs> Hello? I was told you were going to visit me. Who are you? <laughs> I am the jolly ghost of present town. You're going to show me the present? Yes, indeed. 
my friend. What exactly are you going to show me? The result of your action. My, my actions? What, what do you mean by my actions? Oh, old man. I am your mirror, the reflection of your own flaws, the living representation of your own greed. Except I'm nowhere near as ugly. Oh, well, what is it you want to show me? I have many toys. This one is my favorite. Come on, don't be shy. Press the button. This one? All right. Tell me, Boozoo, what do you see? That's... That, that's Banny. Yes, and look at that. The young lady has nothing to feed her brothers. She doesn't even have anything to give them for Christmas. All because of you. Oh, no. I, I didn't mean to. This isn't what I wanted. Doesn't matter. They'll all be dead eventually if you keep wasting your life away. <laughs> You see, your greed doesn't only affect you, it affects everyone. But I never wanted this! Doesn't matter. Your actions have already affected them. Eventually, everything will be gone as it should. It's a beautiful cycle of self-destruction. But, but you I... You already wasted most of your time. You should think about what to do with the little time you have left. Dear God. What, what are in those presents? Are, are they staring at me? Oh, you'll see.
be aware of it now. Are, are they okay? Yeah, they all die. You're killing them. Stop it. You don't need to accept the deception. I beg you, please don't let them die. Please! Your actions are out of my control, old man. This is it. It's your turn.
Hmm. What's this doing here? Hello, Bozo. Are you the, the third ghost? I am mortality. But I'm not ready yet. Please. <laughs> no one is ready, Boozu. Please. Oh, Boozu. You still don't understand, do you? This is it. Like everything else in this world, we turn into nothing eventually. It's always been, and always will be this way, my friend. <laughs> oh, and what a life you've lived. Constantly running away from me. Running away from your problems. Running away from even yourself. <laughs> it's far too late for that, old man. You're running out of time. Which reminds me, we don't have any more time to wait. For you see, your future awaits behind this door. Tell me, am I going to be okay? To normal. Oh, everything is okay now. Oh, Benny. Oh, you don't know how glad I am to see you. Benny? 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 Help me, please. I need to. 
What? What does this mean? Don't touch me! child. It's you. Sir, can you help me find my house? Oh, yes, indeed. Come here. No, kid! What is it? <laughs> Boozy was found like this the next day. Nobody could find an explanation for his tragic and somewhat mysterious death. But he was gone, and thus, our story ends. 
Hope this teaches all of you little children a lesson. Be nice and always think about others. You wouldn't want three ghosts to visit you during Christmas, would you? Of course not. Hope all of you had a fun time listening to the story, and I'll see all of you some other day. Goodbye, and Merry Christmas. Santa Claus is coming to town. 